All right, there you go. There's my son. You guys have heard a lot about him, and here he is. So he's here to help. Uh, he's got a few days before he has to head out uh, to New Mexico, so I guess we'll uh, put him to work. It's only fair, right? You guys have seen all the boat stuff. Yeah, oh yeah. All right, there's my grandson, Bryson. Bryson's in the house. There you go. <laughs> all right, so we got a full crew today, and here's what we're going to do. So before I bring it in the uh, shop, I want to pop the hood, and I want to cut all the radiator lines, and I want to get all the fluids as much as I can out of this thing before we get it in the shop. So let's get set up for that. Yep, it's coming out. There we go. All right. Most of it can get out here on the ground. I'd rather it not be in my shop. Right. Okay. Okay, looks like we got the radiator loose. Let's see if we can get it out. There we go. Garbage. Well, the fan's not. Well, that's a good fan. All right. So now we just got a, looks like we got one line here. We can get that out. And then we can put, start pulling all the, the other crap out of here that we got in here. So, all right, we got a little bit more to go to get this radiator out. I'm going to bust this line off. You ready to get that radiator out of there? Yeah, get, get grab it in and pull. Let's get it out of there. There you go. Oh, all over my tools. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Yep. <laughs> all right, yes. look Look at all the room that we got. Oh, look, they got an extra fan for the uh, the AC stuff. All right, cool. Well, that was a, With a big screwdriver. mistake. Oh, and a free screwdriver. Look at that bonus. This car gets cheaper and cheaper. Oh, yeah. All right, that we're going to rip all this plastic out of here, and uh, we'll bring you back in when we got it. Yep. Yeah? There you go. All right, here we go. Let's see if we got it. There you go. Rip it out of there. There we go. All right, good job. Woo! -hoo. Look at up. Look how much room we have now. now look at all have, that room. Now we have all of this this room. Now we can. Uh, what do we? What do we? Can we do now with all that room? So now we can put some new stuff in. Oh. Or we could just take a little bit of um, some stuff out. How about how about if we take the engine out? Yeah, we we can take the engine out and then replace it, and then put a new engine in. Okay. All right. Well, let's let's work on that. Okay. All right. Let's do it. Yeah. Ready? All right. Okay. Let's uh, let's see if we can get the tire off so we can get that rack and pinion out. Go ahead. Oh, well, there's one. If you guys remember okay, back when I did the red vet, it took me all day to get him off. He's going to do it in no time. Oh, got to pull the... <laughs> yep, put it back on. Okay. Oh, hold on. Spin nope. You gotta spin it with your hand. Yep. <laughs> Keep going. Come on, get after it. Keep going, you can't. Keep going. There you go. Just pull the trigger and hold it down. All right, kick it. Kick it. Can, can you get it loose? Oh, not like that. Not like that. Here's the bottom of your foot. Yeah, like this. There like that. No, bottom. Watch. Look. Look. Watch. You hit with the top. That's gonna hurt. <laughs> there you go. There you go. All right, it's off. We can pull it off now.
All right, job well done, buddy. Okay, what do you need to do here? So, so what, I, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to drill the tire back on with three bolts, and that will be all. Okay, let's do it. Let's do this thing. Just doing it. 16th. You're not on it. Oh, oh. Remember, you gotta get on it. There you go. Okay. Same okay, take. there you go. Drive that one. Right here? Yep. Make sure you're on it. There you go. Good so job. now we got three boats in here. Okay, what are you doing? So I'm taking all of these screws off and I'm um, taking this tire off and then doing um, whatever they need to do and then after that. Um, all right, all right, that's pretty clear. All right, go ahead. Oh, gotta push in. Push in. There you go. Keep going. Okay. Now do it with a hand. There you go. Good job. All right, put that down. Now you remember how to kick it. Put that down. The bottom of your foot. Don't hurt yourself. Almost. Oh, come on. Oh, no. Nope, you hit the top of your foot. It's hard to do, isn't it? With, especially with Crocs on. How about I can kick it right here? No, nope. you're gonna hurt yourself. Just let dad do it. See, and then he goes and like destroys it. <laughs> I didn't even see. There we go. Okay, see if you can finagle it out of there. Here comes the uh, rack and pinion. You're gonna have to get in there and lift and there you go. Just gonna have to work it out. Like that? Yeah. Well, not gonna be able to get it. You got hoses still, and I don't know how we're gonna cut the hoses. Well, yeah. even then, you got the spot that goes up that connects to the actual arm. All right, looks like we got more work to do. So, <laughs> okay, you can see here we got the uh, rack and pinion out. It was a bit of a hassle, but we did get it and not destroyed it. So that was good. Uh, all right, so we're uh, gonna go inside here and he's putting the other tire back on so we can get the jack down and then we're gonna go underneath and see if we can't get motor mounts get it get after it <laughs> good all right okay so we've gotten you know plenty done here so far hey <laughs> Um, we got the sway bar out. I think I told you all that. Uh, we're underneath right now, cutting exhaust out and all that kind of boring stuff doesn't work well on video. So we are going to. We're going to take a little break. <laughs> all right, let's go break. We'll see you. Okay, so we're going to do a status update here. I just got out from underneath it. Uh, got the. The brace that goes between the uh, transmission and the rear end is loose, but not out of there because you can't get it out until the drive shaft comes out. You can't get the drive shaft out until you do a bunch of other stuff. So it all falls out eventually. Um, exhaust is out, so I think we're ready to hook up and start to kind of yank on this engine a little bit and see where we're at. Um, kind of a test just to see where we're at. It's going to be a challenge because we're doing it while it's on the trailer. Uh, if you guys remember me trying to get the trailer underneath the uh, old Corvette once I got everything stripped off it, that was extremely difficult. So we are trying to do all of this with it on the trailer. Challenge accepted. Right? Right. All right. Okay. You ready? Let's do it.
All right, let's do it. <sighs> okay. Let's try it. All right, so first problem that we're running into is uh, I tried to go with the uh, suggestion some of you guys gave me on the last Corvette, which was to come from the side like this. Would that work? Probably work great because, you know, we're not too far off from where we need to be. But, you know, I've got almost a foot of trailer there, and we're trying to do this on the trailer. So I am going to... Uh, roll this Corvette forward until we get just a little bit past the edge of the trailer here and we should be able to get back on like we did on the last one and and pull it out so I don't know how else we're gonna do it it's uh, you know doing it on the trailer is just really making it challenging but it's really challenging getting it off the trailer and back on the trailer so all right, there you go. We got it pushed back on the trailer enough to get it out. We should be able to hopefully have enough room now to get back up on there and pull it that way. All right, let's try again. Here they go, pulling the engine out. There it is, everybody. The engine pulling out. Look at that engine, that is, that is the best engine ever. Off of the rear of the... That is definitely the engine. It's bent. This probably has a lot of fuel. Lots of lots of fuel. Here goes the engine that is running fuel out. We are trying to make it stop, but there's no way. Now we're going to make this stop. There we go, we got it stuck. Isn't that right, Grandpa? What's that? Isn't it right that we got the fuel stuck? We got the fuel shut off. Yes, we got the plug. Not, not dripping all over now. No more dripping, guys. There they go, taking it off. There it goes. And there he is. Grandpa showing off his silly moves. Oh! There goes a screwdriver off. Looks like a screwdriver went off. This is on live TV. They are trying to get the engine out, but they can't. Okay, 
So we're going to take the uh, and drop the rear end on this thing first because it's we're having a hard time with the drive shaft binding up and all that and you can't get the drive shaft out with that brace up in there. I, it's just easier to drop the, the rear end. So we're going we're gonna to do that real quick. All right, we'll get you back in when we got these off. Hey, okay, we're down to our last bolt. We are less at our last boat to getting this brake out. The rear end. The rear end, That's I mean. I saw something move. It's out. <laughs> Alright. Okay, back to the engine. Hey guys. Okay. We're gonna give it another try here. We got the drive shaft completely pulled away. Rear ends out. We hope that's all that was holding us up. pulling up the engine for now right, let's do it because finally we cut the wires Finally, getting the motor out, the engine out of the car.
And the rear end out, the engine out, the only thing left is the front suspension. So now we got the engine out, and we did pretty much a lot of work, and it took us a while to get it out, but we got it out. Okay, well it looks good. We got it settled on a rack or whatever, a dolly, so we can stuff it in a hole somewhere. And we got a big hole left where that was, so uh, the rear end's sitting down on the trailer back there, so that can be yanked out. And the only thing left to be to do is yank out these two uh, front suspensions. Not tonight. <laughs> All right, so we'll uh, we'll hit we'll hit this again, but uh, for now we're gonna leave it where it's at. All right, guys. So we tried. We tried to get it done in a day. We're really, really close, so uh, we've already gone in, we've gotten showered and eaten and all those things, and I'm, I'm just back out here kind of cleaning up, uh, wrapping up a few things, but uh, we got really close uh, as far as, you know, getting this thing completely stripped down. So, uh, engine's out. The rear end is basically just laying on the trailer. I just need to pull it out of there. It's ready to go. So the only thing left is the uh, the two two uh, pieces out here on the front suspension. All right, so now that we got the whole rear end disassembled and you know loose from the vet, we're gonna use the old trusty <laughs> old timey crank here and uh, winch, and we're gonna pull it out from underneath there. All right, all right. So let's get this done. Jack came off the other, or Jack stand came off the other side and fell, and the vent almost rolled off. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna try and get this up and get this cribbing underneath here, so when I get to the uh, scrap yard, they can get their forklifts underneath it, and also keep it from rolling off of the trailer like it just about did. All right, we're gonna get the front up on some cribbing too. All right, let's get the other side. Here we go. Much better. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna get the uh, front suspension off of this thing now that we got it up on the cribbing and uh, secure better and not gonna roll off our trailer. Uh, so Bryson's taking care of that. He's gonna get that tire off so that we can start stripping out our suspension in here. You guys have seen that before, so we won't deal out, detail that too much. I think Bryson's looking to become a NASCAR pit crew. Look at the speed. All right, get out of the way, fast, move fast now. <laughs> okay, okay, you've got the other side to get. There you go, move in. There you go.
There you go. Good job, Bryce. All right, good job. There we go. There you go. All right. All right, go ahead and zip that one off there. And go. Get what are you going to do, Bryson? I'm going to take these ropes off like these things and this thing. All right, let's get at it. Hold up. There you go. Got to be on it. Go ahead. Whoop. There you go. Make sure you're on it. There you go. Make sure you're on it good. There you go. There you go. Push. You got it. So what we're about to do is we're going to take the brake off. The front expansion right over there. If you can see. Right there. See, we're working. There you go. Don't get too close. There you go. Right there. You see what we're doing? Yeah. There we go. We did it. Okay. I gotta get out of here now. Coming down. Alright. Alright, let's get these out of there and be done with this thing. Alright, here we go. There we go. Out of here. <laughs> here we go. Boom! We're all done. Okay, well, like Bryson just said, boom, we're done. So we are finished. We're going to wrap this video right here. I appreciate you guys watching. Say goodbye. Bye. All right, Ryan. See ya. All right, guys. Appreciate it. Thanks, guys, for helping. And I'll see you guys on the next video, all right?